Hey, man, it's Prince. What's going on? So, hey, what's, um, what's happening, man? When it comes to the death penalty, I'm 50-50. Um, if you did something real egregious like Dylan Roof, you, you got to go. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm sorry. You got to go. <laughs> Dylan Roof, he's got to go. Yeah. They better, okay. they better do it. He's got to go. Um, if, you did, if you didn't do nothing too egregious, then, you know, jail time, you know. Yeah. Life without parole or, you know, some type of jail time. Yeah. Of course. Um, if you kill, kill, if you harm any type of, if you harm children in any way, death penalty. If you harm uh, your family members, um, death penalty. You got to go. Yeah. And, yeah. Um, especially children. But. Yeah, like I, I said, mean, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. Hang on, I don't mean to cut you off, but, like, okay. children, like. You, 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 yeah, see, it's easier for me to be all philosophical, oh, let's be Lynn Tor But you mess with children, I probably would drop all the facade and say, F it, burn them at the stake. Like, I, I get kind of ruthless because I kind of, uh, that's a sensitive spot for most human beings. Like, um, I wish Adam Lanza didn't kill himself so I could, anyway, go ahead, Br uh, go ahead Bryce, finish up. Yeah, I know, thinking. I know, but that's, that's, that's how I feel. Like, if you did do nothing too, out of control, you shouldn't get the death penalty, of course. You know, you should take jail time or whatever like that. But if you did something real bad, you got to go because it just doesn't make any sense. Yeah, you man. You know, in, in terms of to be, to be here. It doesn't, it's, there's no purpose. Now, obviously America has used the death penalty the wrong way. Yeah, And sometimes they got it right. Yeah. So that's just how it kind of goes. It's like a catch-22. Yeah. It is. It is. And that's the problem. That's the hard part. Thanks for the call. Um, I want to get some other people in on the conversation. 857-600-0518. Um, that's the hard part, right? So I just contradicted myself. And it's not an easy thing. I contradicted myself because I, I'm pretty sure I would, I would be the first in line championing for us to execute somebody who harmed children, right? But because the state has been so inaccurate, and they have executed so many innocent people, you, you, you can't be for one and then against the other, right? I mean, emotionally you can, but I just, you know, the inconsistency still kind of messes with my head, to be honest with you. It, it messes with my head. This is, this is one of the many places I am, one of the few places, one of the two places. There are two places that I'm conflicted with my progressive ideology, and, and that is with the death penalty, uh, depending on the case, and war, depending on the case. Because, as I believe it was, I don't know if it's actually a theologian who said this, but I heard someone say that Thomas Aquinas actually said some people just need to be killed. <laughs> and, I mean, we can't, we can't be peace at any cost. Not all the time. Sometimes peace is going to cost. But that's just my twisted way of thinking.